I've been meaning to put the video up for absolutely ages. I was asked about it weeks ago now, and I just completely forgot. I did the video ages ago and then just forgot to uh, do anything with it. I was asked about um, a flow driven program for perfect numbers. Having not done a great deal of maths myself, I didn't really know what a perfect number is, so I had to look it up. Um, perfect number is a positive integer with the sum of its positive divisors, excluding the number itself. So 6 has the divisor 1, 2, and 3, excluding itself. So 1, 2, and 3 is 6. So it's 6 is a perfect number. And what the guy wanted, um, I'm assuming it was a student project, um, was a way of uh, identifying how many perfect numbers there were in a range. So I'm not going to take any credit for this. Um, I had a quick look. It looked like a simple project. And then I did the obvious and I had a look to see if it was in the manual. There is, don't forget, if you look at my website, uh, boring.org.uk, you'll also find a link to the, uh, to the manual um, or the project guide. Excellent project guide with loads of example projects in. And this is actually in there. So I've just um, taken it and redone it a little bit. Um, the original is in Italian just convert it to English, it's, it was no big deal. So this is the, the program. So if I have a look at that, enter your number, calls the perfect function. There's a perfect function that does all the, the working out for you. Okay, so I'm not gonna go into, uh, into any great detail. You've got plenty of time to have a look at it, pause the video, and copy it, but I will run through it. There we go. So, oops. so let's run it. Um, n times greater than 2, so let's say uh, 3. Enter um, up to number, so I'm going to say 100. Let's see how well this program works. So this will be all the perfect numbers between 3 and 100. So 6 we knew, 28, perfect number, they're the only two. So let's run it again. So three and let's go with 500. Obviously it's going to slow down a little bit. Not sure the program actually stopped. 496, look, there we go, and done. So there you go, a program for working out the different perfect numbers within a range. Hope that helps.